I'm, I'm so happy that the story is finally told. I cannot even begin to tell you. I've, I've had this weighing on me for five years, and I mean, it's, it's pretty, it's pretty special. It's pretty remarkable to find something that you can keep enthusiastic. On. I mean, I mean, like the amount of charged energy, the energy that everyone has put into this from day one is like. It's strange that it's over because instantly you wish that you had that back. It's like I want to keep worrying about it, but you know, I feel good about walking away as well. Bella, for five years, do you think she'll be with you for the rest of your life? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I think so. I think it'd be pretty hard to shake something like that. And if fans have been satisfied with this film, what do they need to know about this final movie? Um, it's a trip. It really is very different now that uh, now that Bella's not a human anymore. It's like full on Twilightville, and it's weird and in the best way. It's like it's a very conclusive, really satisfying end story, I think. And what's the next step for you? What's the final question? What's the next step for you? I don't know yet. Genuinely, yeah, I'm not sure. I I, I want to work. I'm like desperate to find something that I love. You good? How you doing? I don't know. <laughs> Just mayhem, muddled mayhem, getting pushed around everywhere. <laughs> but it's nice though, it's nice after five years and it's still got this energy. Um, yeah, it's really good. I can't believe people are still camping out. I mean, it's the last one, <laughs> luckily. Are you going to miss any of this? Absolutely. I mean, it's such a unique perspective that I've got on life now. I mean, I, very few people get to experience this. Uh, it's been it's been fun. It's been exciting. Yeah, you go back to meet the Robert five years ago. What advice would you have given him? Try and try and get in a movie called Twilight <laughs> and play Jacob. <laughs> uh, music boys. And you're looking very dapper this evening, sir. Thank you very much. Awesome. Okay, sir. I think it'd be really, really frightening and depressing. <laughs> Are you a bit superstitious? Do you maybe believe in vampires and supernatural forces? I'd like to, but uh, I don't know. I've never seen any proof. <laughs> Saw a ghost the other day. What's the best thing that Twilight brought to your life? A ton. I mean, too many things to count. I mean, it's a totally different life. I mean, I'd be... I don't know what I'd be doing without this. <laughs> like, and it's, it's, it's a fun life. And that I'm totally deaf. How are you? Good, thanks. I loved it. I loved it. Yeah, there's definitely a lighter side to Jacob in this one. He's more comedic. A, a huge weight's been lifted off his shoulders. So it was it was fun to play that side of him. Not fun one bit. <laughs> no, it's always it's always so awkward because you don't realize I'm the only one stripping on set. I mean, it's like I'm with a bunch of people who are putting on clothes because it's freezing outside, and then it's time for me to take them off. So now it's, but it's a funny scene. I'll definitely miss him. I'll definitely miss all aspects of Jacob. He's a tough character to say goodbye to. Jacob has, he has a more protective side. How did you feel exploring that, and where did you get your inspiration from? It's awesome. I mean, Jacob's been waiting to imprint this whole series, so it was uh, it was very cool to, to use that protective side of of Renesme. And um, did anything fun happen on set? Like anything funny? It was a main job. I don't even know if I could it's choose cool. one. Though. I mean, we all we, we're yeah, like a family now, so we're always laughing. We're always having fun and teasing each other and joking around. It's it's a great vibe. Unlike the hair and makeup chairs for like 15 minutes, and some of those girls take hours. I think I, I think all of the girls literally take you know an hour or two. But you know, it's, it's whatever. Yeah, I do. I do. I like changing it up a bit. I mean, I'm, I'm a simple guy, but it's it's nice every now and then to get dressed up. Thanks, guys. Thank you so much. Yeah, we decided it'd be really fun to sort of break up the monotony of the of the fight uh, by um, surprising Bill with a with a dance as opposed to a fight. So when he called action, we'd all choreograph this dance that we, we did. And as opposed to charging against each other and fighting, we danced towards each other. And um, it made Bill laugh a lot, so it kind of, it did the trick.
Now, huge yeah, changes are for in Jacob's life. In this oh, amazing. Movie. It's, it's amazing. It's such an honour to be yeah, here. I think I love the Twilight Saga. I'm such a big fan. So it's such a treat to be here and have it celebrated in this way. Who's a lot happier of course. I think love is what makes the world go round. It was, gets us out of bed in the morning. So absolutely, I think it's an amazing thing. Chose Edward over Jacob. Some people have had a tough time with that. A lot of people have differing opinions here about whether that was No, I don't believe in vampires. I do believe in there being something greater than just our art, flesh and bones. Um, but uh, I think Mother Nature is pretty magical and amazing. Um, we don't need to make up anything more amazing than, than that. Would you like to live forever? No. Goodness gracious, how dull. No, no. I think you would forget to, you wouldn't be able to put your, any value on, on your time and, and, and your experiences if you knew that you could just do them over and over and over again. And what's the best thing that Twilight brought to your life? Um, a roller coaster of an adventure. I spent six months filming Twilight and I had such an amazing time. I made so many great friends and um, yeah, I, I loved it. Thank you so much. Diana. Hi, um, this is your second year of Twilight Madness, so how does this year's premiere compare to last year? Well, obviously this premiere, because it's the final um, film of the saga, there's a different sort of element to it, that's for sure. Um, but it's, it's just as electrifying as it was the first time. The first time was my first time, and I guess this time is my last time, so they're just as magical for different reasons. Have you had a lot of crazy fan experiences since you signed on? I have had only amazing fan experiences. Everyone's been so generous and kind when really they could have been quite harsh and critical. So I, I'm nothing but really grateful to all the fans. They're wonderful. Thank you. So